Hey, what's going on guys? How's everyone doing today? I'm doing well, thank you for asking. Welcome to another episode of The Body Beatdown. I'm Michael, your sensationable, sexy, I don't know, I'm your host. So, we are on week number four, which is coming to a close Friday, of this new routine that I'm doing with one movement per body part for the entire six weeks. So today is shoulder day. It is Friday Eve, i.e. Thursday afternoon. And uh, I don't typically do a whole lot of shoulder uh, videos, I don't believe, but I need to. Um, now, I don't know how heavy I'm gonna go today. And uh, the routine is just kind of up in the air as far as the weights that I do and the sets that I do and all that kind of stuff, whether it's heavier and a little bit lighter or lighter and a lot more reps or whatever it is I want to do. It's kind of up in the air. Um, today I'm not feeling super strong like messing with those 80 pound dumbbells but I don't know. Uh, things usually change pretty quick with me. So uh, yesterday was my arm day bicep and tricep and I, on that day during this six week test I do concentration curls and uh, two arm dumbbell skull crushers where you're laying down and that right there and yesterday on about the sixth or seventh set however many i did i did a lot with the 80s uh i kind of i, I kind of failed on my attempt and i was on like maybe three rep three or rep five or somewhere in there it was kind of a low rep i believe and i just kind of i went oh and i set the, i had to set the dumbbell here on my uh well, basically on my hair. I was laying down and it was on my hair and it was flopped up and the dumbbell was half over on my neck and I was holding it and I was in pain and I didn't want to drop the dumbbell because I didn't want to hurt my floor and I didn't want to hurt the dumbbell and I didn't want to hear the noise. And so it took me a few minutes to finally muster up the strength to kind of work the dumbbell up slowly uh, to my chest and then I was able to sling up and sit up on the bench so I've never had that happen but I almost kind of expected it because I really burnt myself out with the 80s I really tore it up but the funny thing is and I know this is kind of off subject of the shoulders but the cool thing is is I proceeded to do another like maybe five sets or so with 50 pound and then I followed it up with the with the last set with 80s for 10 reps how that happened I don't know but I was really proud of it so anyway that's kind of where i'm at today i'm a little sore from having that weight sitting on me a little bruised feeling or something i don't think i'm bruised but you know how you feel like you, you used muscles that you're not used to using you know when dumbbells are sitting on your face eh, what muscles are you used to using there i don't know so anyway long story longer i don't really care you're here watching it i'm watching you so we're going to do a little bit of shoulder uh, sitting dumbbell shoulder presses. Uh, we'll get a few. Uh, we'll get a few sets and a little bit, and maybe talk a little bit. But uh, I don't know what I'm going to do. So I'm just going to start out with the 30s, and we'll go from there. All right, I'll see you over there at the bench. Come on. Starting with the 30s. Nothing serious, guys. Starting with the 30s. So, while you guys have been away, I'm on about my fifth set or so. Uh, we've worked our way up to the 50 pound dumbbells in five pound increments from 30. So, uh, I've been getting like 15 reps. Uh, so, let's go ahead and we'll at least film these 50s. And uh, if I decide to go up to the 80s, which that's all I have, I go from 50 pound to, to 80. I gotta get more dumbbells. Send me some dumbbells, guys. Anyway, let's get these 50s, all right? Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, 10, 11, 12, 13, 
14, 15. Well, I got my 50s done. And as I suspected, I'm probably gonna try and go ahead and go with the 80s, even though I'm sore. I think I'm gonna go ahead and try and push out a set of the 80s. And uh, it's never a pretty press, but I like the heaviness uh, that I put on my body. And you gotta have uh, you got to have stress and strain and move some heavier weights to progress. So whether they're textbook beautiful or a little off, as long as you don't throw something out and you know your own body and you know your limits, go for it. All right, so let's go ahead and throw these 80s up. Also, you're going to notice whenever I kick my dumbbells up, I try to keep my elbows in and kick them up like so because of my bad arms that I have tendonitis or tennis elbow or whatever it's going on. Plus I have arthritis in my wrist. You notice I'm not wearing any wraps or gloves or anything today. So I'm going El Natural. So, all right, let's get these 80s guys. I think I can do them. Let's go ahead and try another set of the 80s. That's exactly what I wanted to do, was eight. Whew, beautiful. And if all goes as planned, I'll do a set of six next. All right, guys, catch your breath. We'll go on to the next set in a minute. Now I'm filming all the 80 pound sets because it's my heaviest dumbbells that I can do. And it's more impressive than watching me press 30 pounds or 50 pounds. And uh, it'll kind of give me something to look at and, you know, kind of critique and, and uh, anyway, you know, give me something to look at to, to judge myself. So, I hope to get six. Job. I really only wanted to get six, but I was really hyped. So let's cool down and we'll get another set of the 80s. Set number four. Now I really do hope to just get six. And excuse the noise, my neighbor's mowing. And I just opened the windows up, get a little air. Very beautiful day out, very warm. Let's get six. <clears throat> yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six, yeah. I'm proud of myself. Good job. Ah. One more set of the 80s. So I'm gonna catch my breath in between uh, that set and, and my final set of the 80 pounds. Get some water. Always have some water, guys. Whew. 
So I've been searching on Marketplace pretty heavily, uh, like all the time. But I found a couple of decent deals today. I've kind of reached out, reached out to some guys on there and a couple of different, couple of different things on there. And uh, well, we'll see what happens. I don't have much money to spend, but if I can find a good deal on a couple of things, then I might jump on a couple of things. So only problem is it always involves me having to drive like an hour away or two hours away, you know, and then back. So it takes a little while. All right, I'm rested. Let's get that last set with the 80s. guys well I appreciate you tuning in to this amazing episode of the body beatdown hitting some shoulders today I still have five more sets to do I'm dropping down to my 50s and I'm gonna get sets of 10 and uh, burn my shoulders up pretty good eventually when I can I'm gonna get some some more dumbbells from uh, 50s up you know 55s and up whatever and uh, of course I have the 80s and I have hundreds and uh, I actually weighed the dumbbells uh, a couple of days ago and they're actually a couple of pounds heavier than what they say so I'm strong so anyway I uh, hope you enjoy this little series I'm doing go back and look at what I'm doing again it's a six-week program that I just kind of come up with myself doing one movement per body part for six weeks uh, Mondays I do legs Tuesdays I do chest Wednesdays I do bicep and tricep, which would be arms. Thursdays I do shoulders. Fridays I do back. Saturdays, how do you like how I'm alternating that? Saturdays are deads and uh, sometimes I'll mix some uh, biceps off in there. This is sign language for biceps. So uh, yeah, doing my shoulders up good. I'm really happy with what I did with the 80s, super happy. So having problems and everything, really happy. Um, anybody who tries to downplay 80s like they're not heavy, go try them, not easy. Especially when you're severely hurt the whole time. So anyway guys, uh, thanks for watching. Go check out all my other videos, like, share, subscribe, comment, all that good stuff too. The Body Beatdown with me, Michael, your incredible host with the most. And uh, we'll see you next time. And don't forget, inspire someone today, tomorrow, next week, along your way, along your life. Most importantly, inspire yourself because you matter most. Get up, get out, get rad, and freaking do it to it. Get up, get out, get rad, and do it to it.